Good morning, everybody. So we got a little project for the mini. It's fired her up. It's nice and cold this morning. Uh, we got an erosion around a culvert pipe, big culvert pipe, going under a road here. The uh, pipe should have been put in a little, at a little bit more of an angle, so the creek is flowing straight. And then it has to turn to go into the culvert pipe. So with all these rains we've had, you can see how high the water's gotten. It's just eroding this out. So I'm going to dig this back and put some fabric and some riprap in here to kind of help armor this road bank right here and keep it from washing out and potentially causing a road failure. good size culvert pipe that's probably about an eight footer it's just about two foot of sand in the bottom of it so I'll work on getting that fixed up really can't that needs to be dug over so that the creek straight but they probably won't like changing the creek too much so just gonna put some rock in here and uh, get that fixed fixed up Here's a prime example right there is how that erodes out. See how that water is sitting there spinning around? See how it's hitting the pipe and spinning around? That's what causes this erosion right here. As that water is coming around, say in a flood, you know it's two foot deeper, three foot deeper. It's hitting the side of that pipe and it's spinning around and that's what creates a big washout area. Someone knocks that out so that the riprap will go down into the ground and uh, we'll go ahead and put some fabric down. Now I got the fabric in, got the blade holding it so when I put the rock on there it won't pull it down. Got some staples but I got it, you can see I got it cut back a good you know, 12, 16 inches right there. And uh, fabric all the way up against the pipe and I dug that out so that uh, the rock will be down on the ground about a foot or so. I can pound that in there and then stack it all the way up and that will protect this slope. And hopefully 
it'll push the water over and it'll wash that little hump off right there. I'll have a little straighter shot into the pipe. Now we wait on a rock. Let that slowly come out. on my pipe there.
Got the rock put in now. Got it kind of packed down with the bucket. I had a little extra, so I just put it around the pipe. So I got a fair amount put in here now so that I could kind of deflect that water over so that it'll go into the pipe and not keep eroding that out. Should work out good. I kind of pushed the creek over a little bit, so maybe it'll kind of wash that corner off and make it more of a straight shot into the pipe. So that's done. That should uh, fix that problem. Also, put a little bit of rock in that corner over there in case it tried to wash over there. 